of many people. And um, I don't know why, I just felt called to presence that. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, I, I think that the, you know, the, the, first of all, the ability of human beings to, to endure the kind of suffering that, suffering that, uh, that we are able to is is uh, empowering and also is is also awful because of uh, sometimes the, th the things that people uh, put up with. Uh, your comment reminded me of um, of a book that I really love called um, A Paradise Built in Hell, uh, written by Rebecca Solnit, uh, and she basically goes uh, she takes examples of uh, six situations or so from the last hundred years where basically there's a disaster. Uh, some of it's natural, some of it is uh, human imposed. Uh, and basically just seeing how human communities react. Uh, bureaucracies, the elite, those who have, uh, who stand to lose lots in a situation of chaos, uh, react in a very regressive way and often in a violent way. But, you know, people um, who are just, you know, faced with this situation come together uh, and the flexibility of individuals and the emotional connection between individuals in those situations turns out to offer this really um, optimistic and inspiring vision of what human nature really is. Um, so, you, you know, you've seen examples of, of, of this in, uh, for instance, in New York City at 9-11, uh, you know, stories of people coming down and, and putting themselves in, in harm's way. Uh, are incredible. Uh, other stories from that book go back to a to an earthquake in San Francisco in 1906. Um, but I think it's true that uh, you know beautiful expression comes out of the suffering. Um, so yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know if uh, you know what to make of that in terms of you know what it means about the role of uh, of, of war. But but I think it's definitely true that you know these. Um, you know, it's 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 amazing what can come out of this, and and in this film, which what what you all just watched, uh, one of the one of the most moving things for me is the the poetry festival in Medellin, uh, people coming together and you know talking about these really truly awful situations, uh, and sharing it in a way that you know I I uh, watched that as you know being a uh, a forum you know filled with um, filled with love for one another so. Thank you, Arthur, so much for taking your Friday night to be here with us. Your insights have been incredibly thought-provoking, and um, this has been a, a really incredible Q&A session. So thank you very much. Great. Yes, uh, thanks a lot for having me, and thanks, thanks so much for coming out. All right. Good night. That was so exciting. Oh,